Civil Protection and the Italian Army uh, were using a helicopter to uh, check the instrument on the summit and the flanks of the uh, Mount Stromboli, the island in the uh, Mediterranean Sea in the southern Italy. And then they witnessed this event, uh, explosion, a pyroclastic explosion, which created the flow, avalanche of the pyroclastic uh, material. These are the hot, uh, shattered rock pieces and ash which flow like an avalanche down the slope. And uh, the result is this event. We see it now here, um, moving toward the... Um, Ionian Sea, that part of the Mediterranean Sea, which is adjacent to the Sicily and the mainland Italy. From a distance, of course, it looks beautiful. You can have beautiful sunset, take nice, uh, you know, views of this. Uh, and you can see here, this is a, uh, a quart, first quarter moon and the hot pyroclastic flowing down. This is the map of it. There are, this slope is unstable, so you don't see any grass on it. That's the reason. Uh, this shows that the resurfacing of this uh, mountain is all the time happening on that side. It's a nice thing to view, but not a nice place to work if you have to go there and do it. From down in the village that you can see here, it looks spectacular, beautiful, threatening in a way. And it creates uh, sulfur clouds, which can also make the, you know, travel a distance, like what uh, Mount Etna did recently. Stromboli also do the same. In this region is dotted with the volcanoes. You can see Stromboli itself is just Lira Island. This is due to the African plate undergoing subduction on the Italian plate. Is the oceanic plate going down, is rich in water because it's been in the ocean, full of water, and then comes back and explodes. Because the parent magma, as we said, uh, comes from a water-rich oceanic crust.